central North Island of New Zealand, preparing for the T42. T42 is a marathon run. It's a bit of an unusual run this one, but it's downhill for the first 20 k's and kind of essentially uphill for the last 20. Um, you do drop overall about 1300 meters and climb about 700. This is an event that I've been wanting to come and do for the last uh, five or six years but I've never been able to get here because it's always clashed with another event that we have up in Waihi, uh, the Nugget Knob Sport Festival. Uh, but this year I've finally been able to get here since the night was cancelled so I'm looking forward to getting into it. I'm not sure how it's going to go. I haven't been feeling that flash this morning, but who knows? I'll either um, get better as the day goes on or uh, clap out completely. Um, but yeah, we'll push the boat out and see what happens. From a strategy point of view, it's going to be a bit dangerous to take off too fast. And the temptation is obviously going to be to give it a bit of a nudge for the first half when it is downhill. So we're going to need to resist that temptation and leave some gas in the tank for what's quite a substantial climb the second half is mostly gravel roads and pine forest. First half is mostly dirt roads like this and uh, this regenerating native bush. It's sort of a game of two halves really. So yeah, I guess a little bit conservative in the first half. Maybe the real marathon probably doesn't start until the second half. So got to keep that in mind and resist the temptation to uh, go too quickly at the start. I have to say, they said that it was uh, all downhill for the first 20 k's and I've just walked a couple of hundred meters into the trail and it's all been uphill. <laughs> so that could be a bit of a trap as well. There's always little macro hills within the overall profile. In terms of a goal time, so it's a really tricky one to try and work out. Just having a look at the um, finishing times from last year and the winner did it in about 3 hours 30 and there were probably 15 people between 3.30 and 4 hours. It won't be 3.30, I'm pretty sure of that since my fastest marathon uh, on a flat road uh, was about two months ago and it was 3.47 but it's probably going to be somewhere between there and maybe four and a quarter hours. Look at that mountain up and behind, that's gorgeous. Yeah, so see you on the start line. Bye. This has obviously been a very average last couple of years. It's been a while. Yeah. <laughs> is in 53 minutes it's been quite good we just went through a really muddy patch i was able to like, take a few people I've been running with a group for the last sort of five k's and i just get away on my own so i can focus a little bit more on my pace and form and stuff i've had a couple of little warnings around the cramp thing on my inside left thigh which is where i get it the most so i've had a couple of salt tabs I'm just trying to manage the pace Sticking on 5 to 5.15, so I guess on the flats, 4.45s on the downhills and the uphills or whatever they are. Feeling better than I did earlier on this morning. Ooh, that's game. Yeah, that's the line. Oh, that was a bloody cold. Thirteen and a half caps. Oh, I've got a bit of a climb, getting out of here. Yahoo! We're at uh, 15 k's, a lot of uphill from here. Kind of marks the point where the Grade changes, if my memory serves me correctly. A bit of grunting from here on. So it tracks a little bit more technical too, which is cool. Grab a 
roads, doing seven minute k's, just grunting up the hill, and, uh, trying to get through it really. But uh, it is what it is. So now we just gotta get the hills over, wait for the next down a bit. Bad bikes are pushing. Just hit halfway. Near enough. Back on the uphill. Just had a pretty long downhill, which is kind of nice. But now we've got a bit of a grunt again. I think it's a series of just ups and downs, ups and downs for the next 10Ks. So I'm just trudging along. I think um, whatever my place is, I don't know, I'm guessing somewhere around 25th. It's probably sort of locked in now. I don't see anybody around. I'm not catching anybody. Uh, maybe still going to get caught by some others. I've already got no idea where I'm at anyway. So doesn't matter, it's quite good. I'm just trying to run my own race at this stage and pace myself to finish strong. So I've hit the 30k mark. We are uh, 2 hours 48. And yeah, it still feel reasonable. And take on along with the bike. Keep it up a good pace for the last 5 k's. Uh, yeah, it's been quite fun. 12 k's to go. Feeling alright. Cramps stayed away so far. So just got to manage that to the finish. And uh, see how we go. Hi. Hi, I'm good, thanks, mate. Cheers. So we've got 4 k's to go. In the bush now, it's uh, quite a change. It's cooled down quite a bit. Quite nice running. Uh, bought on cramp for me about 4 k's back. As soon as we entered the bush, that chain just locked my leg up. I managed to walk for 30 40 meters and came right. Seems to be quite good again now. So, yeah, feeling really good, I have to say. It's been a really good day after feeling pretty average before the start. I've really felt I've been a bit of a flow state all day. Um, managed to overtake about half a dozen people in the second half. So it always feels good. Yeah, now 4k to go, I feel like I can sort of truck on quite well and finish pretty strong. So uh, I'm going to go and do that and I'll catch you at the finish line. Into another patch of bush, I can hear the music at the finish line now. So I think there's about 1k loop to do in here before we hit the finish. Now it's 41.4k's. 3 hours 47. This could actually be the first one. So that was the T42. Um, ended up being about 3 hours 50, I think, which was okay time. Ended up finishing pretty happily. Um, felt like I had a pretty good day out there. Probably the best I felt in a marathon ever. Yeah, so really happy. <laughs> With the way it's going, I actually really enjoyed the course. So very happy that I've come down here and ticked this one off. I'll have to look at um, what we can do next now. Right, so that was the T42.